begin at Mount Carmel High School where a teacher has been arrested on suspicion of sexually abusing a student. Jail records indicate 40 year old Stacy Michelle Walker turned herself in and was booked into custody yesterday. Police say she sexually abused a student in a relationship that stretched more than two years from 2017 to 2019. Police say the student came forward last July and an investigation was launched. Walker was arrested on suspicion of 17 felony counts, all of which were sex crimes. She is set to be arraigned tomorrow. And an associate principal at Hoover High School is facing child porn charges. 41-year-old Charles DeFreitas was taken into custody yesterday. And ABC 10 News reporter Madison Weil is joining us now live outside the school. Madison, you learned that police are searching for additional victims? Now, Kim, this is another very disturbing story. I can tell you that the students and families that we spoke with today were understandably shocked to learn this news. According to police, the associate principal here at here at the school was arrested after sending and requesting illicit photos from a minor. Well, I talked to him like a couple times. Hoover High School students learning that their associate principal, 41-year-old Charles DeFreitas, was arrested for inappropriately communicating with a minor. Crazy, like, I, has he, like, been doing it since he got here, or, like, I don't know, this is crazy, like having like all that and like working at a school too. On Thursday, parents at Hoover High received this letter detailing that DeFreitas was arrested off campus on charges of distributing lewd matter to a minor in possession of obscene matter. The school says DeFreitas has been placed on leave and will not be allowed on campus. We tried to contact DeFreitas at his home. When we knocked, he did answer the door, but told us he did not have a comment at this time. According to police, an investigation was launched after a minor said that DeFreitas had sent and requested illicit photos via a social media app. Detectives then served a search warrant and seized several of DeFreitas' devices, which they say will be analyzed for additional evidence. They say DeFreitas has worked for the district for more than 13 years. More disappointing that what I hear about this just this is just uh. the district says they are working with police and supporting investigators as needed adding that counseling services are available for any student who may need it as we mentioned, police say they are looking for additional victims at this time. Anyone with any additional information or concerns is urged to reach out to SDPD. From Hoover High tonight, Madison Weil, ABC 10 News. Disturbing charges there. Thank you, Madison.